Hey, this is Mike Newsom, your host for Independent Scoops. We're back off break. I told you I had a guest for you that I wouldn't tell you before we went to break. So I've got them here now. I've got Daryl and Erica of N Productions, and N Productions stands for Erica and Daryl Productions. And I'm going right. to let them tell you about what they do. Yeah, uh, right now we are some up-and-coming uh, mixed DJs uh, in Atlanta. Uh, me, fit, male and female. Yeah, that male and do. female, yeah. We trying, right. to, we trying to do it like that. Okay. Um, right now we're just dealing with a lot of hip-hop, R&B, uh, dance, music. Trying to put a different uh, spin on it, you know okay. what I'm saying? Really trying to bring music back where you listen to it and it's relevant. Okay. You know, so... Um, that's, that's basically what we're trying to what, do. What here. you're trying to do. So tell me, what, what, where did this idea come from? Um, it Really, it was just us. I mean, for us, music is our life. You know what I'm saying? So okay. the idea is just to present it to people. We got tired of seeing it the way it's, it's going out there, man. A lot of people aren't selling the records that they need to sell or getting the, the, the credit that they need to get. You know, and I think the way that we present it with the mixes and we get it out to people, it really makes a lot more artists relevant. You okay. know, with, with their sound and the way they're trying to come out. Okay, so Erica, would you say with what y'all doing with music, what, what, what are you doing, what are you guys doing different than any other DJ you think? What, what kind of flavor that you gonna bring to the ATL or Atlanta? We're gonna bring you things that you've heard already. Okay. And we're gonna bring you things that you haven't heard from different new artists or artists that had previous albums that didn't do so well or that single never got released. We're gonna put that in there and we're gonna put it in with the stuff that you listen to and give it a completely different sound. Okay, so, so where did you guys get this idea to start working together and collaborating, doing what you do with music? Well, we already did our own mixes just for each other. We right. would have like, oh, okay, I have this mix. I want you to listen to it. I have this new artist I want you to listen to. And so we just did that already together and then it wasn't till a couple of months ago where we were just like, we need to do something with it because it's just too good. Okay. Everything that we play for everybody, they're feeling it. They like the new artists. Mm -hmm. And we just figured we should do something with it. Okay. So where do you guys see this thing going in the next five years or 10 years? Where, where do you want to see it go? Another 10 years, we want to be in production. Okay. Yeah. We want to be producing and making our own music. Okay. And getting new artists. But, um, but no matter what, we want to bring the music to people, you know what I'm saying? So no matter what, we want to, uh, you know, start as a stepping stone and then definitely go into production, uh, arranging stuff for an uh, artist's album or just really okay. being the person that's letting them know okay. what, what needs to be out there in the streets and what people are ready to hear from an artist. You know? oh, okay, so talk to me about some of the versatility. I mean, y'all deal with certain types or one type of music. Everything. Uh, hip hop, R and B. Nah, what you doing? Nah, nah, we do it all, dog. Do it I all. mean, we uh, we start off with just like <clears throat> the hip hop, you know, uh, the fire series. Uh, it's uh, up to six now. Uh, just just basically keeping it to a to a good vibe, good party vibe. But uh, we also can, you know, kind of flip it over with uh, a lot of the other stuff. The damn series has a good, uh, real good vibe of kind of like club, but still R and B. So, you know, you can still kind of sex it out, you know, if you got your little female okay. or something going okay. on and still, you know, be able to switch it up on them. So. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So Buzz has it in Atlanta that there is no night spot or venue that has a male and female DJ. What y'all think about that? They need to get one. They need to get, <laughs> they need one. To get one. So what, they, they ain't doing the time. numbers. Yeah. So you heard it, Atlanta. There you go. You yeah. got the dynamic duo male and female DJs. That, that's ready to do it and put it down. So all you club owners that's looking for a hot DJ, again, if you see it first, you saw it first on Independent Scoop, where you get the scoop first, and we're going to take a break, and we'll be right back. Man, we need to look good for this party in this DNK for spot, man. All right, we'll see. They got everything you need. Welcome to DNK, fellas. How can I help you? We need some suits, man. Suits? Follow me. Hey, this is Mike Newsom with the Independent Scoops, your host. I want to take this time out, guys. I think everybody needs to, and we need to pay tribute and homage to the great legend icon, Bernie Mac. We're going to miss that brother. I mean, many years of laughing. He's definitely taught me some things about being a parent. And uh, 
Guys, we're going to miss him. We're really going to miss him. The brother died Saturday morning, 50 years old of uh, lung complications and double pneumonia. So I just want to take this time out and let the family know we send our condolences. And uh, we make no mistake, uh, it was his time God does what he does and, and the time that he does it. But we just want to let you know from Independent Scoop, we're here for you. And uh, we'll see you next episode.